where there is smoke. Ihibaro has information that will surely lead you to La Habrea. Finally, I've got some honest to God's information on your masked man. Why so confident? Because I saw him with my own two eyes. I was out for an evening stroll minding my own business when I noticed a column of smoke rising from a cliff over at Thal's respite. Curious, I took myself there to find a masked man. Your masked man, I'm sure of it, standing by a fire. As if in answer, Samka Kern appeared so soon after and the group began talking at length. I'm afraid I was too far out of earshot to hear much of anything. After the group had dispersed, an idea came to me. If I were to use this smoldering coal to start a fire, you might be able to arrange a similar meeting. It will be dangerous, I shouldn't doubt, but you've proven yourself more than a match for a pack of rats. So what do you think? That some sound, reliable information, even if I do say so myself. Well, well, well worth all the lingering about you've been doing, wouldn't you say? Yeah. I'd actually pay him for, for that kind of information. But too bad we can't. <laughs> Just bad for business. <laughs> Alright, let's go. What is over there? Oh, okay. I don't have that yet. We're gonna kill a bunch of those right now, so we can definitely skip this. We'll be killing way too many of those. And uh, yeah, as I said earlier in my videos, like if there's somebody doing one of the fates, I'll join in. But like I, w I won't start it because we're doing the MSQ. Like I'm willing to help another player is, is what I'm trying to say. There. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. Come on. Chocobo. Okay. Smoldering coal. Looks like materia even. Empire? No, just another pugilist actually. Kaioken. But th that isn't really my masked man though. That is not my masked man, but he is masked, surely. We actually didn't explain, no we did, that he was robed in black, he hooded, and uh, he has a mask, but we didn't say a red mask. Could have helped. Could have also said he's super evil, super wicked, like there's shadow energy emitting from him and like, like super bad guy. Uh, th this guy kind of looks like one of those bandits that you find on the road. Like he's just hiding here or something for like some carriage to pass by from one of the merchants and just uh, ta -ta -ta -ta, attacks them, you know, gets the stuff and like a looter. Yep. Although I could end it. I uh, let's end it, let's end it. Come on. Ah. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, I thought it was actually... I thought this bar was going this way, not that way. I... Might as well finish it, might as well finish it. It's nice, it's nice.
Okay, how many more? Keybinds. There we go. Got some XP and the uh, flame seals and 52 gil. No, we're not doing this one. Alright, let's go. Hihibaro. Wrong masked man. Back so soon? Were you able to find any clues leading to your masked man? Word of the Destroyer. Paper inscribed with the prayer to the patron deity of Alamigo, Ralgar. Ah, <gasps> this scroll. It bears a prayer to, prayer to Ralgar, the destroyer. In case you're unfamiliar, Ralgar is the guardian deity of Alamigo, which is currently under Garlean rule. It's highly uncommon for folk of other nations to revere him. I'd wager my last guild that your assailant was Alamigan. It seems this masked man of yours is very well connected. I must confess, the merchant in me envies such a diverse network of contacts. That same self-merchant also senses danger, and uh, darkness beside. Are you certain you'd rather not take things nice and slow here at Highbridge? No, man. We've got questing to do, we've got an adventure to be on. Okay. 